Welcome back to this weekly show. Uh, this is Tony. This is Winnie. Uh, let's see what we're gonna talk today. Okay. Today we have uh, two growth shoes here. One is for particle mesh and one is for wild light. Mm -hmm. um, but actually these two boys uh, are for feather compatible. Mm -hmm. So we can use uh, alpha ball or wildlife ball here. Okay. Uh, it, it is very useful to use to using a growth sensor. Uh -huh. Then what is the difference oh. for this uh, two? Actually, this uh, growth shoe for wildlife it has a, a lipo battery management chip on it, so you can connect the battery. Battery, yeah. What's next? Yeah, recompute the case. <laughs> So we all know that we uh, our new version is this is our new version the recomputer case and we only have one color is blue and it's only co uh, only compatible for our Odyssey X86 but we are working on a new version that's the silver uh, with the extra color the silver one and uh, uh, previously it's only compatible for Odyssey X86 but. In the future, it's compatible for just a nano, for Beagle Bone and Raspberry Pi. We will, uh, together with the, the case, we will have different side panels. It's different, uh, uh, you can use, you can choose the, the um, suitable side panels and the like standard of stickers. Yeah, yes, and uh, use it together with the case. Yeah, oh, and it's coming next month, right? Yeah, next month. Yes, okay, so you can look forward to it. And today we have, we got a cool stuff here, we call mm -hmm. it just a nano cluster. And by using this board, also compatible with the computer case. Yes. Uh, by using this board, we can insert four just a nano core at the same time. Mm -hmm. Like this, like we can pack it out. And insert this core module on, on it. Nice. Whoa. Now we have three, three core here. Uh -huh. mm. So by by using this cluster, you can uh, do some like multitasking um, computing or something like to get a higher performance. Mm -hmm. And uh, speaking of NVIDIA, there are many different versions like not just the uh, NVIDIA, just a Nano B01 mm -hmm. and also like a TX2 and also this one, the NVIDIA uh, NX, yeah, right? Yeah, NX. One. Yes, and uh, as I know, the performance for uh, NX is much higher than just a Nano, mm, yeah. right? Uh, like when we're using some application like open post, um, huh? we need a higher performance. Okay, like this. This project is called Open Post. And mm -hmm. Open Post is first real-time multi-person detect system. So we can detect the human body, uh, hands, and even facial. Go for it. So it cannot detect the palms? Mm -hmm. Oh, I think it, it, it's a simple version. Um, you guys can go to their GitHub page to get the full version, I think. Okay, so you are saying there is an upgraded version yeah. for the open post, mm -hmm, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so, so it can detect the pumps, right? Mm. At that version. Nice. Oh, so it can um, detect the rear person. What about joints? If I draw something, it can detect also? I don't know. Let's have a try. Okay, let me draw you something. So no matter how horrible I draw, it can detect. Um, let's try. <laughs> Make it closer. Okay. Now it's not working. Oh, fell. Okay, so <clears throat> maybe because I draw too, it's too simple. So, um, how about this? Let's all be serious and we. We have a let's have a competition, and uh, each of us or all of uh, both of us draw something, okay. and uh, to see which one can be uh, detected. Okay. Okay. Um. 
Closer. Hey, wait. Can it? Oh. So it's not working. It's not it working. It has to be a person or something. Hmm. Let me try this one. Oh, it yeah, works. Yeah, it works. So I won. <laughs> yeah. This is so interesting. Hmm. We can. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this project can be used uh, used on some like. Um, Interactive project. Uh huh. Interactive media project, I think. Yeah, that's so wonderful. So, so if anyone, so we can get all the information at their GitHub. Yeah. Okay. Nice. That's all for today. Okay. So if you like our video, please uh, give us a like, and uh, thank you for watching. So see you next week. See you. <laughs>